Hello, my name is Dr. Eric Green. I'm the Internal Medicine Residency Program Director here at Mercy Catholic Medical Center. Thank you so much for taking the time to look at our website and to view this video about the training environment we have here. We're excited to show you the wonderful strengths and advantages we can offer at our community teaching hospital based in urban and suburban Philadelphia. Mercy Catholic Medical Center's Internal Medicine Residency trains its residents at two different hospital sites. Our primary clinical site is Mercy Fitzgerald Hospital. Mercy Fitzgerald Hospital is a 180 licensed bed hospital located in Darby, which is just a few miles from the Philadelphia line in Delaware County. It is a safety net hospital that proudly serves the patients of West and Southwest Philadelphia, as well as the communities of Darby and that surround Darby in Delaware County. The hospital, although it is a safety net hospital, is a full service hospital with full representation for medical and surgical services. This means that we're able to treat our patients in-house, whether they have simple conditions or some of the most complex conditions that we see in internal medicine. We have a full service calf lab, a coronary artery bypass grafting program, electrophysiology, the capability of doing continuous veno, veno hemodialysis and continuous intracranial pressure monitoring in our ICU and all the other things that you'd expect in a high functioning community teaching hospital. In addition, our residents spend about 20% of their time at the Hospital of the University of Pennsylvania's Hub Cedar campus. This is the newest part of the University of Pennsylvania Health Systems campus and it is the former site of Mercy Philadelphia Hospital, which was up until 2021, part of Mercy Catholic Medical Center. Hub Cedar builds on the Mercy Philadelphia Hospital's long tradition of being a safety net hospital, treating the communities of West Philadelphia that surround it. At Hub Cedar, you have access to all of the consulting services from the University of Pennsylvania, either in person or virtually, with the academic and clinical expertise of the University of Pennsylvania Health System. We believe this combination of two hospitals and the similar yet different clinical and patient populations at each of these hospitals offer the ideal training for our residents. At Mercy, we are the residency equivalent of a program that offers big city amenities with small town charms. As a residency, we are 70 people strong, which is relatively large for a community teaching hospital. This size gives us advantages in terms of scheduling the ability to acquire resources, and the ability to hire extra personnel, such as a part-time statistician, to help with our resident research. However, we retain the core values of a community teaching hospital. For example, we have four teaching intensivists who staff about 90% of the shifts in our intensive care unit, and three pulmonologists who provide the continuity of pulmonary care for all of our patients. With numbers like these, it doesn't take very long for a resident to cease to become the A1 intern or even Dr. Green and become Eric. It is our educational intimacy that lets us enhance the learning of each of our residents and make them the best physician that they can possibly become. Our mission at Mercy is to train residents who will serve their communities for their long term. For some, they will end up as primary care physicians, for others as hospitalists, yet others will go on to subspecialty training after their internal medicine residency and then return to the community. In order to prepare our residents for this mission, we rely on three core principles. The first is training in the science of medicine. 
We understand that it is not simply sufficient to teach residents what to do, but we need to teach them the applied pharmacology, physiology, and pathophysiology needed to make them understand the why. Because during all of our careers, we will see what we understand about science to be fundamentally upended. It is only by understanding the rationale of our teachings in residency that we learn what needs to be adapted and what can stay the same. At the same time, we train our residents in the arts of medicine, whether this is the art of extrapolating evidence where evidence does not exist to a unique patient or patient situation, or whether it is the art of engaging in a difficult doctor-patient communication, or whether it is the art of balancing personal and professional needs. All of these are part of our educational curriculum and important to us as teachers and mentors. Finally, we emphasize the values of teamwork. Medicine in the 21st century is not about an individual accomplishment. Our residents learn about being parts of teams, whether they are physician teams or interprofessional teams, and whether they are serving as team leader or team member from the very beginning of internship. Our focus in residency is in finding each resident's unique strengths and weaknesses. We help enhance their strengths and help them remediate whatever deficiencies they find. For us, residency is a marathon, not a sprint. And we know every one of our residents will be successful in the end. Our clinical and academic mission arises from the faith-based roots of our hospital. Mother Catherine McCauley, you can see in the left-hand side of the slides, founded the Sisters of Mercy in late 18th and early 19th century Ireland. She devoted her life to the service of the poor and was known for saying that the poor need our help today, not next week. It is her values and ideals that continue to sustain our clinical and academic enterprise. Our corporate philosophy is contained in this panel on the right-hand side. On a day-to-day -day basis, each of us and our health system lives by the tenets listed here, dignity of the person, the common good, care for those who are poor, solidarity, stewardship. It is these values that influence both day-to-day -day decisions about an individual patient, as well as big picture corporate decisions about what to do with our hospitals and educational enterprise. Mercy Catholic Medical Center is part of Trinity Health Mid-Atlantic, which is a network of hospitals in the greater Philadelphia area. We in turn are part of Trinity Health, which is one of the largest faith-based healthcare systems in the United States. With over 100 hospitals spanning 22 states, our corporate foundation allows us strength in information technology and a financial solidness that we know will sustain us through both the COVID pandemic and beyond. Locally, we are affiliated with two local medical schools, Drexel University College of Medicine and Philadelphia College of Osteopathic Medicine. Those medical schools provide us with intellectual rigor and academic support. At the same time, we train between 40 to 50 medical students at any given time within the walls of our institution. Our residents are expected to be teachers as well as learners, helping the next generation of physician advance in their career. We hope that you'll explore the rest of our website and learn more about the different aspects of our residency. Thanks so much for listening today.